Dr. Olufemi Ile Somi, an outstanding academic, scholar, and public servant of distinction from Arigidia Koko in Undo State, is among the second set of students of the University of Nigeria in Suka who studied geography, graduating in the second class upper division in 1964. Dr. Olufemi Ile Somi attended the University of Wisconsin, Madison, United States of America where he obtained his master's and doctorate degrees in geography. He began his teaching career at the University of Ife, now Obafemi Awolowo University, Ileife, until the 1970s when he left the academia to work with the federal government. Dr. Lufemi Ilesomi worked in various capacities in the Ministry of Aviation as the supervising officer for the Department of Meteorology. He was the pioneer acting director Department of Tourism, Pioneer Executive Director, Nigeria Tourism Development Corporation, NTDC. Tolufemi Ile Somi is a well acknowledged author, both locally and internationally. With the way Dr. Olufemi Ile Somi meandered through the audience that congregated at the Euphoria Event Center in Keja, Lagos, to celebrate his 80th birthday anniversary with him, it was hard to believe that he is indeed 80 years old. The celebration of the 80th birthday anniversary of Dr. Lufemi Ile Somi, which he tagged celebrating God's grace and faithfulness, began with a praise and worship session, which featured songs and a prayer session. Thank you today for every mountain top experience when by the hand of your glory you lifted him to the places of distinction and many gathered throughout his life to celebrate those days of distinction with him I want to thank you for every highlight along the way from when he grew up as a young lad you protected him day and night I want to thank you, O oh Lord, through the early years of school. We want to thank you, God, for marriage. We want to thank you for children, for the marriage of children's children. As we look back, if we had a thousand tongues, we cannot complete the testimonies that are recorded in this place right now. We thank you for the days that it looked as if we were surrounded and all was lost, but yet your light will appear and darkness will be dispelled. We want to thank you as we look back even to the days when it looked as if there would be scarcity. But always, always, Lord, your angelic hosts were there, making a way where there was no way, spearing, protecting, establishing. Father, we want to thank you for this. The reception, which took place at the same venue, featured the presence of many more prominent faces in the different spheres of life, particularly from Lagos and Ogun states, where the celebrant has made long-lasting relationships. Notable among those who came to felicitate with Dr. Olufemi Ile Somi is the younger brother of the chairman of Eleganza Industries, Dr. Chief Tajuddin Okoya, and his wife, Alahaja Rashida Okoya, Chief Mrs. Usilat Seriki, their son, Olufemi, and his wife, as well as a very rich retinue of members of the Island Club, who came to support the Okoyas, who are very close to the celebrant, Dr. Olufemi Ile Somi, and his wife, Dickness Maria Ile Somi. In fact, the BC Olatilo Show, BUS, covered and aired the event as the contribution of its chairman, Prince BC Olatilo, as a friend of the Okoya family. Ogun State Government had in attendance the bulk of members of its executive council, led by the Deputy Governor of Ogun State, Chief Mrs. Yetinde Ononuga who represented Governor Ibikunle Amosu. The secretary to the government of Ogun State, Barrister Taiwa Adeolua, was joined by the Commissioner for Commerce and Industry, Otumba Bimbo Ashiru. The Commissioner for Information and Strategy, Otumba Dayo Adeneye, was accompanied by his wife, Mr. Adewale Oshinowo, Ogun State Commissioner for Finance, who is married to the second daughter of the celebrant, Mrs. Bamidele Oshinowo, Ne Ile Somi, was also present. Mr. Adewale Oshinowo, Ogun State Commissioner for Finance, must be someone very much loved by Governor Ibikunle Amosu, 
to have elicited the great show of support he galvanized for the celebration of the 80th birthday anniversary of his father-in-law. The highlight of the event included the grand arrival of the celebrant, his wife and children, and the opening prayer. In the welcome remarks delivered by the chairman of the event, Ambassador Akinola Shimolu, who was a student of the University of Ife when the celebrant lectured in the institution, he described Dr. Olufemi Ilesomi as an adorable person, a free mixer who can relate with people at all levels of the society. He also congratulated his wife, who has stood by him for over four decades. Appreciate and count our days. For somebody to have skated through all those decades and get into it, I think it's worthy of celebration. Let us thank God that Baba, thank you very much. Dr. Lesomi is an academician of the highest order, a distinguished geographer, a well-known climatologist, a reserved and gentle, easygoing gentleman. How do I come up for this gentleman who holds me as a brother, as a son, as anything? Because I'm in my 60s now, it's already 80. So you can see the gap, but we're relating together. That shows the kind of man that he is. He is somebody who relates with all levels of society. He is a good mixer. He is an adorable person. You can't be with him and say something is wrong with you. No, you will always be happy. And that's why he's always happy now. And he will continue to be happy. Even after 90, 100, we shall celebrate. There were more testimonies from those who the celebrant Dr. Olufemi Ilesomi had made distinct impact in their lives. They all wished him more speed as he trudges on in life. Attribute that I, I learned a lot from him is the attribute of character and performance. He told me that character and performance goes a long way. Some have characters, they don't have performance. Some have performance, they don't have characters to maintain it. But he has the two, he married the two. Then I said that how do you marry um, Pigman, um, the marriage between character and performance? He said, yes, I will teach you certain things. He said, your integrity must be high. And then your, your hard-working ability must commensurate with your integrity. Then he listed almost 10 attributes for me, which I still remember. Then the attribute of stability, the attribute of steadfastness, the attribute of uh, honesty, integrity. He mentioned it to a level that I said, oh, okay, how does it go? He said, don't stay, keep and be contented with your work. As far as we can see, God has blessed Daddy so much and he is fruitful. Second one talks about multiplication and we can see that he's surrounded with children and grandchildren, great grandchildren and the likes of that. He says, replenish the heads and that is doing. He says, subdue it. You know, for someone to be 80 years old, he must have gone through a lot of things. He must have faced a lot of challenges and for him to be standing, he has fought a lot of wars and he has subdued, he has subdued a lot of things. So he has done that as well. And the last one says, and have dominion over the fish of the sea, over the fowl of the hair, and over every living thing. God has given him dominion. So we cannot ask that what is left. I think what is left is just to give praise and continually thank God. And that is one thing I would just like to say to him this tribute, that what is left for daddy right now is to keep thanking God for everything he has helped him to do. And uh, my prayer for you once again, daddy, is that in Jesus mighty name. In the special message of the governor of Ogun State, Senator Ibikule Amosu, which was delivered by the deputy governor, Chief Mrs. Yetunde Onanuga, he wished him well and prayed that 
he will continue to witness the success of all his children and that Ogun State is very proud of one of his sons-in-law, Adewale Oshinowo, the Commissioner for Finance, who is married to one of his daughters, Mrs. Bamidele Oshinowo, nay Ileisomi, which was why the governor sent a powerful delegation to the event. Today he's celebrating God's grace and God's faithfulness in his life. We have had so many tributes about him, and uh, nevertheless, we continue to say thank you to the Almighty God for sparing your life, for making you what you are today. And you are being surrounded by children, grandchildren, family members, and so many well-wishers. We thank God. On behalf of the government and people of Ogun State, I want to congratulate you. One of the reasons why we are here is because of your son. Wale Oshinowo, who is our number one commissioner in Ogun State. He has been a very good help to us in Ogun State and we appreciate what he is doing. That is why His Excellency has asked this powerful delegation to be represented here. The cutting of the 80th birthday anniversary cake of Dr. Olufemi Ilesomi was conducted by Chief Mrs. Yetunde Ononuga, Ogun State Deputy Governor. One, I can't hear you. One, ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, seventy-five, Seventy nine. Seventy nine. In the response of the celebrant, he knelt down and sang a song which he asked all to join him to sing, and then gave thanks to God for giving him the special grace to attain the milestone age of eighty, despite all the challenges. Doctor Olufemi Ilesomi thanked his wife of forty four years. Dickness Maria Elesomi for the supportive role she played all along. While I'm celebrating the children of God, I celebrate all my children and my wife who has been with me for the past 44 years. She has been a pillar to me all along. I've said it in several occasions that she's really a mother. I see her as a mother, and most importantly, as a friend. He has talked with me through all the challenges we face in life. And here we are today, by the grace of God, celebrating the faithfulness of God. And in our journey of life this year, we submit to the will of, uh, the will of God for our lives in the name of Jesus. And so it shall be well with everyone of us. Thank you very much for coming. The celebrant, Dr. Olufemi Ilesomi, joined by his wife, children, and grandchildren, took part in the special celebration dance. <laughs> In the special interview conducted by BUS correspondent, the respondents spoke glowingly of the celebrant, Dr. Olufemi Ilesomi, and prayed for more speed for him. I wish him long life and prosperity. He's a very good man, and at 80, he's a very good man, and he's a, he's a good listener. And uh, I interact with him, and he's a very good business associate. Uh, I wish him long life and prosperity. He's labored over his children, so it's my prayer that even in this old age, that he's going to enjoy peace all around and enjoy the labor of his 
from the fruits of his labor. A mentor, a coach, and a believer in the faith of Christ. This is a turning point for him. We we'll continue to be strong with wisdom, with knowledge and understanding. And I wish Baba well in all his endeavors. The celebrant and his wife could only give thanks to God for the great day, which they are still trying to come to real terms with. I thank Almighty God. I thank all, all those people behind us today to make today's perfect food, especially my children. From Biscon Communications, it's congratulations to the most agile 80-year-old around, Dr. Olufemi Ilesomi.